Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Charles and you are watching Charles Soundbox TV. So in today's video, we have Sebastian, very talented boxer. Sebastian here is, today is going to be helping me with the important principles of how to defend with your hands. So Sebastian, do you want to tell them a little bit about yourself? So as you already said, my name is Sebastian. I'm 19 years old. I'm from Germany. I've got about 10 amateur fights. I'm the federal state champion of my state. And yeah, I box for the Boxer Makulka in Germany. And yeah, that's it. Good, good, good. So Sebastian, just um, take up your stance. So you can see Sebastian's in his stance. He's a southpaw. The first thing that we're going to do is control the distance with um, the lead hand. So I'm going to be the aggressive opponent for Sebastian and Sebastian is going to identify the distance that he needs to safely keep me at with his lead hand, okay? So just pawing there. So I'm trying to be aggressive. Now, the next thing that I would want to do is now try to take up a different position or angle. So if I step here, he moves over there, okay? If I step this way, then he moves over there, okay? So you can see that with his lead hand, he's able to defend against, you know, my aggressive nature by moving his feet and then obviously keeping the distance with his lead hand. Now, if I come too close, he can sneak in a jab. Good, that's it. And then get straight back to controlling the distance with his lead hand. Good, that's it, good, well done, good, that's it. That is what would happen if he wants to keep the maximum distance. Let's say that if I'm southpaw, just to mirror the stances. Now the same thing would apply. So if I'm here with the lead hand, okay, if I move out this way, he's moving out the other way, okay? Good, good. So I'm trying to really be aggressive and he's just keeping the balance, okay? He's maintaining the neutrality between the two of us, just with his lead hand. And if he wants to be slightly aggressive, he can come forward, good. He can take the initiative for the jab, good, that's it. And then get straight back onto defense, good. Good, now moving out to the side, good. And you can see he's just maintaining the distance and then this kind of drill helps him to condition the lead hand as well. Good, that's it, straight back onto defense. Good, that's it, jab, jab, good. Jab, jab, good, good, jab, jab. Good, well done. If he wants to maintain the distance, he can catch my jab with his lead hand and then that will keep the distance fairly good for him to maintain his distance and maintain the fact that he wants to be slightly more out of range so he can work as a boxer. So here, good, 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 good. Now. The reason why this can be problematic, because if he rears off, I can faint and then come over the top with my um, backhand, okay? Now that is obviously the disadvantage from maintaining the lead hand with the lead hand. But what he should do is slightly edge off to my right, which is his left, okay? Good, that's it. Good, good. Good, that's it, good, good. Now from there, he can set me up. He can actually slip on, let's say if I throw two jabs, and then on the third jab, he can slip and then throw a backhand, okay? So we're gonna block two jabs, and I'm gonna step out with the rear foot, and then throw the cross. Ta, good, ta, good. Now step over. Ta, good, that's it. We're gonna try that again. Just show you guys. Ta, 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 good, that's it, good. Again, one, two, ta, good. That's how he can be defensive 
and also set up his counters. So if he wants to slip on my lead hand, he can slip that way, okay, which is my blind side, and then throw the cross. Good. So if he's trying to set me up to throw my backhand, he can be in range now, block with his lead hand, now slip out this way when I throw the cross and then come back with a hook. Good, that's it. Ta, 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 good. Ta, 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 good. Ta, 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 good, that's it. Ta, 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 good. So the next thing that we want to start doing is to bring the um, symmetry between the hands, okay? When he wants to close the distance and come into range, he wants to bring the um, symmetry between the hands. So he wants to mirror and coordinate his lead hand with my rear hand and my um, lead hand with his rear hand. Okay. If I throw a jab out to him, he's gonna block with his rear hand. So here, pa, good. Pa, good. Pa, good, okay? Now, if I decide to throw a one-two, he can catch with the rear hand and then block with the lead hand. So one-two, ta-ta, good. Ta-ta, good. Move around a bit, just a jab here. Ta, ta, good. Now the one-two, ta-ta, good. Ta-ta, good. Now if the one-two is slightly heavy, he can decide to take a small step back on the two. So catch the one, take a step back with the two, okay? So slowly, ta, ta, good. Again, ta, ta, good. Ta, ta, good. Ta, ta, good. Now, I'm gonna go to the body now. So if I throw the uppercut to the body, he's gonna lean over and then catch the punch with the side of his arm, the forearm, and then come up with the uppercut there. So here. Yeah. Good. Good. Good, that's it. Now, on the other side, he's gonna catch the punch, of course, with the forearm, come up with the uppercut there. Good. Good, so you wanna be off the back foot, just be heel up, good, with the back foot, good. Rotate it out, good, good, that's it. Good, keep the he rear hand on the chin. Good, keep it on the chin, good. Good, bring it down, come up. Good, that's it, jab. Good, good, that's it. On the other side, good. So, he always wants to maintain the fact that the hands, obviously the glove is on the chin, and then what he does, he changes, alters the position here to bring the elbow down to the hip, protecting his chin, and then with the same motion coming around from the uppercut here, there, 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 okay? Try that again. Good, good. Make sure that hand is there. Good, good, good. So it's easier to catch and shoot with the same hand when going to the body. There's some variations that exist when you go up top with the hooks to the head. So when we practice that, we've got the hook on the lead side. So we can throw with the same hand, so he will lean slightly into the hook and then come back, good. Good, that's it. And he doesn't want to pivot on the, the lead foot. Good, that's it. You want to rotate on the back foot, then come back down. Good, and the reason why is because he wants to be able to throw with the backhand straight after, so you're going to do that. Good, that's it, get your balance. Good, that's it, wind up on the back foot. Good, that's it. Good, that's it. Jab. Good, that's it. Good, now we're going to go on to the other side. Okay, show you. The same thing from the other side. Good, try not to pivot on that foot. Good, that's it. Watch the pads. 
Good, that's it. Jab. Good. Jab. Good. Jab. Good. We're going to demonstrate now what you do on the other side when you catch and shoot the hook from the opponent on his left side. So here. Good, that's it. Good. So he's going to slow it down just so that you guys can see what he's doing with the back foot. So he first of all brings, obviously, the weight over to the left side and then brings it back the other way, okay? So you want to come out slightly. Ta, ta. Good, that's it. Ta, ta. Good. Ta, good. Ta, good. Now he's going to follow up with that hook and then throw another hook to the other side. Good, that's it. And you can see the only movement that he has is on the back foot. Ta, ta, ta. Good. Ta. Good, that's it. Good. From the other side. Good, that's it. Good. Good, that's it. So the next thing that we're going to do and drill for you guys is the catch and then counter. So he's going to block with one hand and then counter with the other. So we're here. So we block here. Boom. And we catch there. Good. Catch and counter. Pa, pa. Good. Pa, pa. Good. Pa, pa. Good. Now what he's going to do is follow up with the backhand. Throw the backhand here. Pa, pa, pa. Good. That's it. Pa. Good. Good. That's it. Around the side. Good, that's it. Good, that's it. Get accuracy. Good. Make sure you're accurate with the punches. Good, that's it. Good, that's it. Now, we're going to show on the lead side what happens. Obviously, with the lead side, he blocks, first of all, the hook. Pat, and then goes for... But don't worry about leaning over. Obviously, keep your weight on the rear foot. Ta, and then pa. Okay, go through with it. Okay, so slowly to begin with. Ta, pa. Good, that's it. Ta, good. Ta, good. Ta, good. And you can see the way I position the hand here because I don't want him to throw here. I want him to throw here, okay? Good, that's it. Good. Good, that's it. Good. Good. Now he's going to follow up with another hook. All he's going to do is just bring the rear foot back down to the floor, not pivot on the lead foot. So again, slowly. Good, that's it. Try not to pivot. Good, that's it. Good. Good, that's it. Good. Good, that's it. On the other side. Good. 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 We're going to go through a quick round, just moving slightly around the ring and then bring about all of the defensive things that we've done. Just blocking my jab, good, that's it, good, good. Now come back with your jab straight after, here. Bah. Good, bah. good, good, that's it, good. Now double it up, good, that's it. For a one-two here now, good, that's it, good, that's it. Now for a cross, okay? Just cross. Yeah, just a cross. Good, that's it. Good, that's it. Good. Good. Ta ta. Ta ta. Good. Now come back with your cross. Ta ta ta. Good. 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 Ta, ta, ta. Good. Now you come forwards with it. Ta, ta, ta. Good. Be more aggressive. Ta, ta, ta. Good. Jab. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Keep the distance. 
Ta. Stay out of range. Ta. 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 Good. Stay out of range. Ta. Ta. Good. Ta. 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 And then follow up with a cross. After two, after I throw two jabs, then you follow up with a cross. No slip? No, no slip. Ta, ta, ta. Good. Ta, ta, ta. Good. Rear out to the side. Ta, ta, ta. Good. Ta. Good. Rear out to the side. Ta. Ta. Good. That's it. Again. Ta. 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 Good. That's it. Ta. 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 Good. That's it. Ta. 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 Good. That's it. Suck it up. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Ta. Ta. Good. Ta. Ta. Jab. Ta, ta, good. Jab. Ta, ta. Jab. Ta, ta, good. Cross. Ta, ta, good. Now we're going up top. You're going to catch and count with the same hand. Okay. So lean into a bit. I'm going to start with the lead side. Ta, ta, good. Ta, good. Good. Other side. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. Jab. Ta. Good. Jab. Ta. Ta. Good. Jab. Ta. Jab. Ta. Good. It's good to have that defense. Straight up, straight after that jab. Jab, ta, good. Jab, ta, good. Jab, ta, 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 good. Jab, ta, 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 good. Jab, ta, ta, good. Ta, good. Try to stay on the same level. Ta, ta, good. That's it. Jab, ta, ta, good. That's it. Other side now. Ta, good. Good. Ta. Good. Jab. Ta. Ta. Good. Jab. Jab. Ta. 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 Good. Jab. Ta. 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 Other side. Ta. Good. Ta. Good. There. Ta. There. Ta. Jab. One, two, ta -ta. good. That's the end of the video. I'm gonna leave a link to Sebastian's Instagram. You guys should follow him. Try to understand when he's gonna fight next. You know, all the drills that his coach, his amazing coach that he has, has been putting in time and working in the gym. Michael K. Exactly, Michael K. He had international fights. You know, he's gonna be on the international scene and the circuit, so club shows you guys can go and see him as well amazing talent so guys make sure you follow him obviously with the video it's intended to improve your defense with blocks and um, your positioning as well when you're controlling distance so if you feel that this video is going to benefit someone please share the video if you've enjoyed watching myself and sebastian sweat like hell hit the like button, leave comments in the comment section if you want us to do any other videos. I think um, you're gonna be flying back soon, so you might not see his handsome face in the next video, but we'll see if we can get something worked out. Obviously hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to stay informed of any new videos that I'm uploading to the channel. And until my next video, I'll see you guys soon. Peace.